One of the conditions in the thymus gland that can go haywire is the development of a tumor in the thymus gland, and it's called a thymoma. And a thymoma, for the most part, is a slow-growing tumor that exists in the thymus gland. But there is a range of a range of aggressiveness of thymoma. It can range from something that's very benign or non-cancerous all the way through to having a cancer of the thymus gland. And so evaluation of these is important in order to get the appropriate treatment. For small three, four centimeter thymomas that look benign or non-cancerous, the treatment, the recommended treatment is removal of that because as it gets bigger, the chance of developing a cancer or spread gets higher. For bigger thymomas that look like they might have a cancerous component, the treatment for those folks is vastly different, in which case they might get chemotherapy and radiation first, followed by surgery second, and usually in that situation, it's not robotic surgery, it's a standard open incision. So it's it's important, I think, to see a surgeon who has the ability to offer you a minimally invasive approach as well as a standard old-fashioned approach, depending on what stage of disease, how aggressive the tumor might be to get appropriately treated.